Hey guys, so I wanted to show you this because I've been playing a lot more Minecraft recently and I invested some time into getting a resource pack as well as a shader and it has worked out very well. I'll link the videos that I use in the description. It took me a while and you have to be really careful to avoid uh, ads that are actually scams and whatnot on the websites you go to. So definitely be cautious of that if you do decide to try and get this, um, what I'm displaying here. But I have loved it. Like if I showed you my initial reaction, of when I got it, I was like screaming and like kind of happy just for just a second. My family was a little bit concerned, but yeah, like seriously, was so amazed with um how much this can really shape your experience and uh, make Minecraft a little bit more immersive and uh, just more quality, and also give your builds a little bit um more style and um, depth, I guess I could say. But I'll, I'll show you guys my house and uh, definitely a big difference in lighting and whatnot. The texture pack I got um, also adds a lot to it and in contrast they do a lot with each other. The fire is actually like um, vibrant and uh, very moving. And um, you can go upstairs here. This is a survival world by the way. Um, completely built um, in survival. Not cheating with that or with creative or whatever. And uh, I have a few friends that are on it too but this is my house here. Got a few lights around, nothing crazy. I have this contraption to open up if I need to drop some water down there, if there's ever a fire. Because I wouldn't be surprised if I set off a fire myself sometime. But yeah, the chests look very good. A lot of the different resources. There's also a pack for the tools, but I didn't like how the tools look, so I didn't keep that. The anvil looks amazing. And what looks the best at nighttime is definitely, I think, my backyard. So check this thing out with the pool and the hill cave back there I'll call it. I actually just kind of finished up this backyard area and uh, caved that in over there. But um, yeah the water is amazing. It looks very real and it really reflects like everything you can see um, on the other side of it or whatever so that has been really cool. The water is actually a big part of it for me. I just kind of have a cool little room back here with the potion table. Um, like look at it actually gives like a model for the potions on there. Um, the lights look really cool. And that's most of it. I'm going to go around the community a little bit more in the daytime so you guys can see more day. That'll probably be it. So as you guys can see, um, the way the light shines in is actually very um, bright and... Um, what's the word? Um, I don't know. I don't know what to call it. But it, it, just, it, it definitely is a lot shinier. And there's a lot more contrast and vibrance in the light. The light going out and looking at the water, reflecting off the tower, always looks amazing. Like, I still don't get tired of this. And that poor squid, I'm going to put it out of its misery. And there's even animations for deaths like that that are pretty cool. Um, but yeah, here's the farm over here. I can show the water. And look at the trees. The trees are very amazing. The river over there. Um, by the way, my PC is very good, so <laughs> if you don't have a great PC... You're either going to want to try and get the lower quality versions and turn the settings down on this. Because I get like 30, 40 frames per second. Yeah, 30 right now. Especially with me recording, I figure. Um, but like, if you have a lower NPC, you probably can't do this at all. Like, my friend has a decent one. He couldn't even really get it. So definitely look at your specs and take that into consideration. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Show you guys what it looks like in the water. That's been another really cool thing. The way it kind of like shines through in sunrise, amazing. And uh, I think there's a, yeah, there's the zombie. I was about to say, I hear one somewhere. But look how cool the forest looks swimming up to it. Like, bro, that just looks so nice to me. I don't know. We really need to take those trees down there just floating. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show you guys because I've been doing this a lot more. And those of you that normally watch my channel, I just haven't been doing a lot of BRM because they didn't update and uh, whatnot, but uh, I'll be waiting on that. And I do have a few ideas, so I'm just waiting for them to do that. But if you guys want more Minecraft, please let me know. Do you want me to do some live streams on this or um, some more videos with my friends and whatnot? Because I think I'd be down to do that. Maybe a little bit of this survival world. And yeah, that's it. I will see you guys in the next one.